Hey guys, it's Christian here from Core Electronics. Today I'm going to take you through the SparkFun Inventors Kit, the 4.0 version. So this is a kit for enthusiasts and educators, and it's quite a good kit given that it's using project-led learning to teach uh, these enthusiasts and educators like yourself um, the basics of microcontrollers. So today we're going to build the base plate so that we have a good foundation for our projects. I'll start to go into the actual projects um, in future videos. So first of all, we can put the breadboard on the base plate by removing the yellow film from the back of it and placing it so that the numbers run down the length of the board in a chronological fashion. Uh, next, we want to fix the red board loosely to the uh, base plate through means of screws. Um, so it's important to note that while doing this, we just want to fix the red board to the base plate. We don't want to necessarily clamp it on there so tight that it could break it. Now that the base plate is assembled, uh, we can start to get into future projects. So the red board provided in the kit is similar to the build of the Arduino Uno R3 revision. Um, it has a bunch of cool things on, on it that we'll go through now. So the barrel jack is for connecting 7 to 15 volts of power. Um, so the reason that we have a barrel jack connection as well as the mini USB connection is so that we're actually able to put the project, if we want to put it up in a ceiling or on a robot um, that will be driving around or moving around, we're able to do that so that it's got a mobile power supply. So as I just mentioned, the mini USB port is where we can power the breadboard and where we can upload the code to from the computer. So next is a hard reset button that's used in the event that we have an annoying sound going on in some of our sound projects or we just want to manually reset the board at some stage. Uh, next to the RX, TX and pin 13 LEDs. So they notify us when there is something happening at each of those ports or pins. So the RX will flash when we're receiving data on the red board. The TX will flash when we're transmitting data and pin 13 will be high or on when pin 13 is actually high or on and it will go low or off when the value at pin 13 is low or off. So that's a brief overview of the SparkFun Inventors Kit. Uh, in future videos, I'll be going through these projects one by one. See you then.